there's my morning harvest. Of course, I harvested a lot of tomatoes yesterday. I also took out a lot of tomatoes. Uh, that, that was like this one, looking pretty pitiful. This one had so many green ones on it, and some that was about to get ripe that I left it, but it'll come out in the next several days. And so with that one, once they get diseased, you might as well go ahead and take them out. Peppers are all doing good and putting on just gobs of pepper. I'm going to try to make my own hot sauce this year. Uh, I, we had a dip at church Sunday night that was made with Texas peat and um, cream cheese and, and shredded cheese and I don't know what all else he had in it. That's a hot pepper there. But uh, I'm supposed to be getting the recipe from him and this is also a hot pepper. I don't remember the name of it, but it was, on the scale of hot, it was pretty high. So I met, uh, he mixed cowboy candy, which is uh, jellied hot peppers. And I don't remember what all else he put in it, but that stuff was delicious. I mean, it was so good. I brought some home. I got some semi-indeterminate. They're actually supposed to be determinate, but um, they're taller than any determinants I've ever had, so I'm, I'm calling them semi-indeterminate. Um, they're still healthy and putting on fruit. And I got probably two five-gallon buckets in the freezer that are frozen that I'll take out all at once and I'll let the peel break open on them and, and I'll can them. And... A lot of them I've just been eating. And I've been giving the chickens quite a few too. <laughs> got a, just got my, my first pot of okra and saw some blossoms on it. So I should be getting some okra in a few days. And I thought those cucumbers had played out and was just about to pull them out of there. And I started seeing baby cukes everywhere and I decided to leave them for just a little while longer. I see they're getting some mildew on them. So it'll be, yeah, it's, it's probably time to take them out in the next couple of days. They got some that's about first finger long. And, you know, cucumbers overnight, they can get twice as big. So I'll give them a chance. So, and then I'm going to take those all out and start preparing that bed for some winter stuff. I don't, I don't think there'll be any more summer stuff planted. I don't think I'm, you know, you know me. <laughs> I, I may plant some beans or peas in there. I need a cover crop of some kind in there, and legumes are pretty good at that. All right, this is going to be a short video. Uh, happy Independence Day, everyone that lives in the United States. Uh, we've lost a lot of our freedoms. I pray to God we keep the ones that allows us to worship Him together together in Jesus name but I tell you what the way things are looking and with the government we have now that's that's kind of iffy too take advantage of it while you can God bless